this is the instrument which is called as a polarimeter it calculates the angle of rotation and based on the optical activity now what is the optical activity that is rotation of plane polarized light either to the left side or right side for rotation of plane polarized light the compound must have a symmetric carbon atom that is lack of symmetry now let's see the different parts of this particular instrument uh, this is called as an intensity <coughs> meter here is the sample holder you can place the sample whatever you want to analyze inside this particular tube now uh, there are certain conditions of this sample tube that must be fulfilled you have to fill this tube completely up to this mark then there should not be any air bubble inside the sample tube okay now after filling the sample tube with the sample you want to analyze place the sample tube here to the position of P2 this is the most important now this is the intensity meter this is the display board where the optical rotation is displayed then these two are the calibration node you have to calibrate this particular instrument before using it then this is the polarized wheel now let's see how to operate this particular instrument now you can see the reading here you have to set first zero reading into the display board okay now you can see the on the display board there is a zero reading now uh, rotate the polaroid wheel towards this this uh, of this intensity meter this side is called as a maximum and this side is called as a minimum now rotate the polaroid wheel in a such a fashion that the intensity moves towards the maximum side first up to a approximate value then after reaching to a certain value then again uh, rotate the intensity meter towards the minimum side now you can see when the intensity meter is moving towards the uh, from maximum to the minimum there is automatic fluctuation of the intensity meter and that is nothing but the final optical rotation of your sample now uh, you have to first determine the optical rotation of distilled water now you uh, you know that the distilled water uh, don't have any asymmetric carbon atom so optical rotation 